So anyway, so we were talking about lightning bugs and moths that fly around at night. Bugs like the light, they like to fly around and sometimes run into it, right? All right, back to where we were. One sec, Sydney, let's get through this book first. But this is the best bug, but this bug is the best of all. It's, it's a, a ladybug. ladybug. Is that a ladybug? Yeah. Or is that a, a little kid dressed up like a ladybug? It's a little baby dressed up like a ladybug. Oh my goodness. She loves to crawl. And see, look, he's been taking pictures of all the bugs. My baby loves to stand up and walk. Oh, wow. Well, we know that ladybugs can't walk, so maybe it's best just to let them crawl. Bugs, bugs, bugs. I love bugs. Oh, look, is the kitty cat sleeping? Mm -hmm. And there's a little ladybug flying around right here. It's you <laughs> sleeping on the window. window. And then what it's are these out here? So and the way the way the fly. Fly. That's oh. so cute. The ladybug is giving hugs. Oh. All right, so here's a few more bugs before we finish up. These were the bugs that we didn't see at the beginning. So we have an ant. It says some ants can carry more than 20 times its own weight. That means they're very, very strong. Whoa. And they can carry weeks. Here's one. It's called, it's called a deer fly. Deer, deer fly? It says the buzzing of a fly <coughs> is the sound of its wings beating. So whenever you hear a, bu a, a fly buzzing around because their wings are going like What's this one right here, Olivia? Is that, a, is that a praying mantis? It says the praying mantis is the only insect that can turn its head halfway around to look over its shoulder. That means it can look all the way over here, or all the way over here, to make sure there's nobody behind it. It says the moth. It says unlike butterflies, most moths are active at night. So sometimes people like to be awake during the day, sometimes people like to be awake during the night. That's kind of like butterflies and moths. Moth, moths like to be up all night. Moths are like butterflies. They're like butterfly cousins. Cicada. Some cicadas spend 17 years underground. How old are you guys? Four. I'm four. I'm four. I'm four. I'm four. Oh my goodness. So 17, 17 years is a long I'm time, isn't it? I'm three. Yeah. I'm five. I'm four. Okay. Here's one. It's called I'm a so Luna. A Luna moth. It says Luna moths have clear spots on their wings that you can see through. That's the kind of moth that was hanging out by that light at night. That's right. Cricket. The male cricket chirps by rubbing its front, front wings together. So when you hear that cricket chirp, it's because it's rubbing its wings together. Isn't that crazy? It's kind of like a cricket clap. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. And we have a ladybug. It says ladybugs have from two to more than 24 spots. That's a lot of spots on a ladybug, isn't it? There's another ladybug. We'll get to that one here in a minute. That's a baby ladybug. We have, we have the fireflies. As fireflies attract mates by blinking in special patterns. That's a patterns. baby dressed up like a ladybug. And then finally it says, it's baby sister. Baby sister, if a baby sister bugs you, it's because she loves you. How many of you guys have baby sisters and brothers? I have one. I have, I have, I have, I have the baby sister. sister. I have the baby sister. And don't we love them I so much? Yeah. I have no brothers. All right. I have no the brothers. end. All right, boys and girls, thank you for letting me come and read this book to you. I hope that we know a little bit more about bugs now. So when we go outside this summer, maybe we can say hi to them when we see them. Wouldn't that be fun? Can we give Mr. Tommy a big clap?